Laminated counters have always created a unique challenge for installers on the job site. And quite frankly, they created a unique challenge for us at No Lift trying to help solve that problem. But we've solved it with the edge slider. like mitered edges, 2CM stuff that you have to do build-ups, promise you, you're gonna want this, it's a lifesaver. You guys come up with this, and we're planning to use it for our installations. I've always thought that no lift system is, is definitely made for 3CM and had its major benefits there, but I've always thought, well, how could this be made to for a 2CM market? And they've done it, so pretty awesome. My name is Aaron Crowley with No Lift Install System and I am excited to announce that we have finally solved the laminated countertop problem with the edge slider. The reality is it took us longer to solve this issue than it did for us to design and perfect the original cart. Essentially what the edge slider does is elevate a laminated countertop high enough to where the lamination doesn't hang up on the deck during installation. What this means for you is if you're doing 2CM LAM or mitered counters or increasingly 3CM laminated countertops, you now have the full functionality of the no-lift on those countertops. So to begin, we want to place all eight edge sliders on the cart deck, spaced as evenly as possible to provide maximum support for the countertop. And I want to point out that you need to put the short side of the slider in such a way that it clears the shepherd hook sleeve and can just move freely across the cart deck. Once those are on, we want to put the boot over the chalk on the base of the cart. And it's important to keep in mind, you want to position these bottom sliders in such a way that the lamination can clear and slide underneath it. So to begin, we want to push the lifter feet all the way out so they can lift the countertop. Next, we want to loosen the handle on the shepherd hook so that they move freely once in the horizontal position. From there, we use remote control to lift the countertop up to cabinet height. Okay, next we want to remove the shepherd hooks from the countertop. And we'll pull the cable lock to rotate into the horizontal position. Now some folks like to keep their shepherd hooks on the counter until it's horizontal. It's a personal preference. I prefer to remove them for situations like this when the countertop's going to rotate over the cabinet. So once the countertop is over the cabinet, we want to just lower the cart enough to where it's touching. Once it's touching, we can begin to move the counter onto the cabinet. And you can see the lamination is pushing the sliders towards the cabinet, supporting it the entire way. Once the countertop is, you know, a half to two thirds of the way onto the cabinet, you can lower the cart and the sliders out from underneath the counter and the lamination. Kick the cart away and continue to install the countertop. So whether you find yourself doing more and more laminated counters or whether you've been waiting to buy the no lift until it could do laminated countertops, the solution is now available. The no lift install system edge slider. Mm -hmm.